my, my, my parents kept me very educated about the past and stuff like that. And I always uh, had older, older uh, you know, people in my life that would always tell me things, you know, to keep me educated. So it wasn't just about being in, being involved. I always had that passion to be involved and fight for my people. So. What I realized is, it's, it's happening to a lot of young black men. So for me to, you know, not be that one person, it's, it's a lot to, you know, make a Twitter post or make an Instagram post or, you know, say something about it. But to actually be there and show that you actually care and show awareness, and this is all about showing that the teens care, to showing that the youth are here for change. Police, stop police! Police, stop police! Police, stop police! The moment that made me decide to come out here and support was, it was just like, you know, an addition of things happening that kind of spurred it on. For example, first it was Breonna Taylor's um, murder, and then it was Yassine's murder here in Georgia, and then hearing about the death of George Floyd, and it all just created kind of like a bushfire and started, you know, this revolution that we're on, and I don't think we're stopping anytime soon. Say his name! George Floyd! Say his name! George Floyd! Say Just seeing the oppression that our people have gone through, continue to go through, and just, you know, now it's time to stay to stand for and hopefully make some changes. Peace.